Okay, today what we're going to do is we're going to learn how to convert a RGB image into a transparent GIF. And transparent GIFs are basically uh, images without a background. In other words, if we take this camera and we put this camera on a, a web page uh, with a black background, it's going to have this white background all... Uh, that comes along with it. We want to be able to get rid of that. So what I want to do is I'm going to create a layer below this uh, layer one, and uh, just to simulate uh, the background of a web page, I'm going to uh, color it. So let's color the uh, uh, the web page uh, simulation black. Uh, because that'll give us the highest contrast uh, between uh, the white background and the black background. First thing I need to do is go into my, I'm going to use my magic wand and make sure I'm on layer one and select all the white and then delete it. And deselect and get up really, really close to see what we got here. Now, I'm, I'm noticing that... Um, there's a little bit of fringe, white fringe, in the uh, on the image itself. Just a little bit white fringe. I don't know if you can see it in the video, but here's what I, you know. Here's what I suggest you do. What I do is I suggest that you go up to uh, layer. Come down to matting and use uh, choose the defringe, and I would say defringe that by about oh maybe two pixels for this particular image anyway. And let's bring out the simulated back black background. Now the the back the background layer is only simulating the color of the page. Uh, let's change the color and see what if it makes any difference. It still looks good here. Let's make it a uh, looks and let me go in really, really, really close to see you make sure the edges are all yeah, it's looking pretty good. Okay, once I've simulated the background and I'm happy with the image, the next thing I can do is just get rid of the simulated uh, web background right there. Now all I need to do is save this image as a GIF. And the quickest way to do that is hold down Control, Shift, and uh, and Alt. Alt, Shift, Control, or Control, Alt, and Shift, and hit the letter S. And that'll bring up this huge, tremendous, humongous uh, <laughs> The dialog box and basically the only thing you need to make sure that you have the, uh, selected is GIF and the transparency. Uh, all the other settings you can experiment with and do anything you want with it and just click save. Uh, you can see in, in here I've done uh, several test images already. Uh, I'm going to call this one uh, ZZZ and save it and okay now I'll get rid of this it's going to ask me do I do I want to save this and I'm going to go no okay now just to see what we got here I'm open I'm going to open up the ZZZ image and there it is and what I'll do is Look at it really, really close. It looks good. And we're ready to go. This image is ready to be put onto a any particular uh, web page, with, and it'll be transparent. I promise you.